just like a chaste wife she will only enjoy with her husband not that she has no potential to go with so many men but no that is chastity so similarly in the material world material enjoyment is just like going after so many men in one sense it's like this soul is engaged in prostitution his real enjoyment comes in association with the supreme personality of god at krishna who is capable of giving us unlimited an- ananda unlimited happiness giving up that we have in search of so many things so krishna will give us back that ananda provided he is seeing that they have have they lost faith in this so called enjoyment without me as this living entity given up the faith and the lord is waiting in our heart to give us bliss of devotional service waiting very anxiously whether we are giving up the desire for sense enjoyment so we have to attack this enemy of desire for sense gratification desire for independent enjoyment don't focus on individual desires how to control sense this that go back deep into it how to, what to do with the senses in our devotion service we have been told engage your tongue in prasadam eating engage your tongue in chanting engage your uh, every sense directly like ambarish maharaj how he used to do with his all his senses you engage in dotail in devotion service that direction is there but go behind it and look attack the desire for sense gratification the desire for sense gratification whatever you do it will not go unless the higher taste of real enjoyment comes in association with krishna therefore it is said by starts with hearing about krishna so unless we hear about krishna we have to understand any amount of logic any amount of intellectualizing any amount of sankhya understanding will not help 